हेलो एगेन सो टुडे वी विल स्टार्ट फार्माकोलॉजी ओके एंटी हाइपरटेंसिव ड्रग्स वी विल स्टार्ट विथ कार्डियोवास्कुलर ड्रग्स ओके टुडे वी विल स्टार्ट एंटी हाइपरटेंसिव ड्रग ओके सो इफ दे आस्क यू एनी क्वेश्चंस रिगार्डिंग एंटी हाइपरटेंसिव ड्रग्स देन फर्स्ट यू नो डिफाइन द हाइपर ओके वॉट इज हाइपर सो लेट सी हाइपर इज हाई ब्लड प्रेशर इफ यू आस्क मी इन वन इन वन वर्ड ओके इट्स हाई ब्लड प्रेशर इन वन सेंटेंस इफ यू आस्क मी एक्चुअली ओके सो लेट सी द डेफिनेशन हाइपर टेंशन इज अ कंडीशन ओके इट इज अ कंडीशन इन विच फोर्स ऑफ ब्लड फोर्स ऑफ ब्लड अगेंस्ट ओके अगेंस्ट द आर्टरी वॉल इज टू हाई फोर्स ऑफ ब्लड अगेंस्ट द आर्टरी वॉल इज टू हाई लेट सी दिस इज द आर्टरी ऑफ नॉर्मल पर्सन ओके लाइक अस नॉर्मल पर्सन द आर्टरी यू नो हैव इनफ स्पेस राइट यू कैन सी द आर्टरी हैव इनफ स्पेस सो दैट ब्लड कैन फ्लो without any problem without any issue here in hypertensive patient the artery becomes narrow okay see the artery became from this to this narrow it becomes narrow so right now blood doesn't have enough space to flow properly na so to flow properly blood has to put you know pressure against the artery walls pressure against the artery walls so that uh, you know blood can flow without any problem without any issue but right now they are having issue so they are putting Uh, pressure against the uh, blood vessel so this is called high blood pressure or blood pressure okay hypertension so hypertension means blood pressure above 140 by uh, 90 mm of hg but in severe cases it uh, goes above to 180 uh, by 180 mm of hg okay <coughs> remember this okay after that you will define anti hypertensive drugs okay after hypertension you will define anti hypertensive drugs so here the name is you know uh, telling us very clearly that uh, anti hypertensive drugs means the drugs which we give to control our high blood pressure okay so yeah let's see drugs responsible for lowering or controlling the high blood pressure it's easy right now let's see the classification of anti hypertensive drugs okay anti hypertensive anti hypertensive drugs let's see it start with <coughs> ace inhibitors okay ace inhibitors angiotensin i will start with all the a okay ace inhibitors angiotensin alpha 1 blocker 3a complete now understand the b b beta and adrenergic blocker now c calcium channel blocker central sympathetic uh, sympatholytic now here d diuretics then alpha beta adrenergic blocker and vasodilators i remember like this now it's uh, you know up to you how you will remember ac inhibitors diuretics angiotensin antagonist alpha beta adrenergic blocker alpha 1 receptor blocker central sympatholytic calcium channel blocker beta adrenergic blocker vasodilators i remember it like you know alphabetical manner uh, like ac inhibitors angiotensin alpha 1 receptor blocker then beta blocker then calcium channel blocker then central uh, sympatholytic like that okay so let's start uh, ac inhibitors to the, the first one okay let's see <coughs> now at first you will write the definition of ac inhibitors if they ask you any questions regarding ac inhibitor so def- let's see the definition ace it's angiotensin converting enzyme i will tell you what is uh, what is this okay angiotensin converting enzyme inhibitor okay inhibitor inhibitor means stop angiotensin you know it stop angiotensin converting enzyme in an agent okay in an is an agent block the angiotensin converting enzyme <clears throat> okay angiotensin converting enzyme inhibitor do what block the angiotensin converting enzyme to prevent converting of angiotensin 1 to angiotensin 2 now let's see the mechanism of action so that you can understand what i am talking about okay let's see the mechanism of action of ac inhibitors mechanism of action means how this drug you know work so at first liver produces angiotensin okay liver produces angiotensin actually sorry angiotensin and tensinogen angiotensinogen liver produces angiotensinogen <coughs> 
now blood pressure you know decreases in arteries so kidneys will detect that any time when you know blood pressure in the arteries were in the arteries decreases kidney will know that okay artery uh, you know blood pressure decreases in our arteries kidney will detect that and kidney will produce a molecule called renin okay whenever the blood pressure in the arteries decreases kidneys will get to know that okay so blood pressure is decreases so i have to produce kidney has to produce a molecule called renin now let's see what renin does so renin enters into the circulation okay uh, in the arteries renin enters now renin converts the angiotensinogen 1 to an angiotensinogen to angiotensin angiotensin 1 okay liver produces angiotensinogen now kidney you know whenever the suppose today my blood pressure decreases so my kidney will know that okay today's you know uh, her blood pressure decreases let's produce uh, renin so after renin will go to the artery and you know she will tell angiotensinogen she will tell angiotensinogen let's convert into angiotensin 1 now angiotensin 1 circulate into the body you know circulate into the body and contact with the membrane bound enzyme called ACE ACE you can say mainly found in the lung tissue okay ACE mainly found in the lung tissue now ACE converts angiotensin 1 to angiotensin 2 okay now angiotensin 2 does what angiotensin what is the function of angiotensin 2 angiotensin 2 actually increases the blood pressure so in hypertensive patient uh, you know hypertensive patient what will they have to do we have to you know stop this ace to convert angiotensin 1 to angiotensin 2 why in this part only because angiotensin 2 is the main uh, you know angiotensin 2 is main responsible for mainly responsible for increasing the blood pressure right so angiotensin you know in this portion we have to make them stop in hypertensive patient so if ace can't convert angiotensin 1 to angiotensin 2 angiotensin 2 will not produce thus the angiotensin you know let's see angiotensin inhibitors inhibiting in inhibit converting angiotensin 1 to angiotensin 2 angiotensin 2 responsible for increasing blood pressure so ac inhibitors you know stop angiotensin 2 thus it decrease the blood pressure i hope it's clear if you have any doubt let me know thank you